Mr. Vishal, congratulations on securing All India Rank 43 with the Mechanical Branch in Thank Gate you, 2022. Thank so you. So please uh, introduce yourself. So I'm Vishal Subramaniam. I'm from Coimbatore, Tamil Nadu. I completed my bachelor's degree at uh, PhD ITEC in Coimbatore in nice. mechanical engineering. Mm -hmm. I passed out at 2020, and after that I got campus placements in LMT Technology Services, and I worked there for almost six months. Mm -hmm. And after that I left my job and I came to prepare for GATE. I joined this again, and mm -hmm. it has almost been a year. So what is the program you have taken in AS? What is the so, program? Uh, it's live classes in okay. online modes. Online live classes. Congratulations. So rank 43 with live class support is really an extraordinary achievement. Thank you, sir. So how you enjoyed our live classes? Just briefly. Uh, it was really good, sir. And uh, actually the live classes I initially uh, didn't plan, but uh, as I wanted to prepare for GATEM, there was no classes starting at March. Uh, mm -hmm. I joined into live classes so that uh, for on a temporary basis, so that I can join to uh, classroom classes during June and July. But due to COVID, this became like a, uh, uh, okay. uh, uh, like a better thing. And I started preparing comfortably at home. And, uh, it was very good. How and many times you revise yourself using live classes, Mr. Visha? How many times uh, overall you revise the subject? Sir, I used to watch the videos just once because uh, that was way too enough and it was so clear and precise. All the teachers were really good and they did it really well. And, okay. and using all the materials from years and it took a lot of time in solving all those volume one volume two. It was more than enough for learning. Sir. Okay. Have you availed our study material also? Yes, sir. Yeah, I took the study material school. Okay. Have you written our uh, test series? And test, test series, I uh, didn't almost. Uh, I started uh, test series is way back. Like uh, I paid for 20, 21 uh, test series, and I started practicing topic wise test series first, and then uh -huh. subject wise, and then. I didn't take much of the final mock test. I took almost like 10, maximum 10. Okay. But okay. Uh, I used to analyze them more than the time I took while writing the test. So. Okay, in the exam hall, hmm. what was the pressure you were having in the examination hall? So this time it was kind of different in the exam hall because usually uh, the questions will be of mixed difficulties and this time every question was uh, tending to be appear like uh, more in the lengthier side to read itself and uh, usually the exam will be like this but there will be some direct easy questions too. So I was searching for those questions but there was no such questions in this exam and I even though it took a lot of time in solving the one question itself. I spent more time in solving and I left four to five questions in the end. So on a sacrificial basis. So See, you said that uh, you got campus placement in LNT technologies. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, you left that job later? Yes, sir. Yeah, I left the job only then I came to prepare for GATE. So you are very confident of cracking the GATE exam. See, nowadays, yes, uh, majority of the students, once they get some campus placements, they are leaving all the books, everything, and they are trying to settle in life. So what yes. prompted you to take risk? Sir, I was working in uh, computer-related engineering, like uh, I was working as a finite element modeler. Okay. And my job is to model the given models with the hypermesh and I like the subject, but I wanted to explore more in terms of applications and going back and doing some research in those areas. So that made me help uh, uh, this uh, to motivate this towards studying. I had my plan. I planned to work for two years and then to study, but I felt it was the time and I also felt confident uh, studying now than later. So uh, I did that. Very nice, Visha. Thank what you. is your suggestion to juniors? So for juniors, uh, it's pretty easy. Sir. Like everyone can crack this, but they should have a right mindset till the end. They should not give up. And uh, they should be confident about the preparation. Preparation strategies differ from person to person, but their mindset should be the constant from the day of preparing till the end. They should be confident that they'll be uh, cracking the exam. So. What may be the right time to start preparation for GATE or engineering service exam? Means uh, we take first year or second year or third year. What do you think? Uh, yeah, uh, I prefer third year. So third year is better because second year will be so tough with all the core subjects also. So I prefer third year because they will get some time in it. They should okay. at least start looking towards the direction uh, in third year. Okay. What is your suggestion to juniors, future aspirants? 
future aspirants yes sir they should be constant in their mindset they should not fluctuate will they be able to do this or not they should be always confident and must be keep preparing even if they feel down they should take a small break they should not feel and go down they should keep preparing the things okay vishal congratulations once again convey our regards to your parents thank you sir. thank you all the best god bless you okay. thank you so much thank you